Hello. Oh, I'm not going to do that because, guys, I've shaved my pits off. I didn't mean to. I shaved them too. Uh, I trimmed my... Uh, we're not going to talk about my pits. I trimmed them. I accidentally trimmed them shorter than usual. And now I feel bald. Okay. We're here to do more Game of Thrones. Okay. One episode today. This should be a quick one. And that's a lie. We're going to be here for at least half an hour. I can just guarantee it. Um, today's episode is titled... The Battle of the Bastards. I'm sure you guys knew this. That's why you're here. I have heard that the last two episodes of this season are infamous, okay? For being some of the most intense, yet insane. Whether that's good or bad, I don't know, okay? I don't fucking know the tea. I've just heard that these two episodes have a reputation, okay? You guys did not did mention that I probably should upload the last two episodes as separate reactions just, cause, just so that I can give each episode their time and not feel like I need to cut things out to make it shorter. So that's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna do this today. I'm gonna be filming the next episode straight after this, so you should get it relatively soon after. I say this. And we'll, we shall see. The lights are red. I don't know why they're coming across as orange on camera. But in real life, they could not be more red. Okay? And that's because I'm expecting blood. Right? With all that said, we're just going to crack on in because I'm nervous and scared. And I'm hoping Ramsey Bolton will get fucked. Okay? Rough. Quick shout out to the patrons. Thank you so much for being over there, for supporting me. It really does not go unnoticed. If you guys are interested, every episode and TV show and movie or whatever that I do put on the channel goes on Patreon a few days in advance. I'm completely unedited. So if you want to see my full thoughts without any edits, they're always over there. If you've got recommendations, do not leave them in the comments. I've got a Discord server. There's a channel over there for you to put all your recommendations and I check that regularly just to keep in tune with what you guys are after. Um, so, yeah, take them over there. I won't be seeing them if they're in the comments, okay? So, yeah. I think that's it. You don't need to follow me anywhere. That's all right. Subscribe, please. That would that would be lovely. Subscribe if you enjoy. And, yeah, let's go. <laughs> Guys, we're getting to the end of another season. I know this one's taken me a while. I don't want to fucking air it. So this is going to be the battle for Winterfell. And I'm sorry, if we're going into battle, as we left off in the last episode, John and that are not prepared. I love this vest, but it gives me, do you know, like that armpit vagina. Oh, well, we're catapulting some shit. Oh, these are the, mas the masters, right? The masters are attacking Marine. You are a master of the fucking obvious. What the hell are we going to do about this then? I say get, let's get on the dragon. You know, give him a quick poof poof. That's what I say. Fight appearances, I think you'll find the city's on the rise. The city's on the rise? Marine is strong. <laughs> oh, oh, well, it's hard to make your point when, you know, there is constant booms happening from attack. If Marine succeeds, a city without slavery, a city without masters, proves that no one needs a master. Because they don't. What's not clicking? What's not clicking? Good. Should we begin? Should we begin what? What are we doing? I will crucify the masters. Period. I will set their fleets afire. Yay! Kill every last one of their soldiers and return their cities to the dirt. That is my plan. I think that's a wonder. You don't approve. You once told me you knew what your father was. Did you know his plans for King's Landing when the Lannister armies were at his gates? Probably not. <sighs> well, I'm afraid, Tyrion. Has talking to them worked? He had caches of wildfire hidden under the Red Keep. I don't think it has. The Guild Halls, the Scepter Baylor, all the major thoroughfares. This is entirely different. You're talking about destroying cities. It's not entirely different. Fair enough, but can't we just kill the lot that are attacking us currently? Woo! We're poofing! Come on, let's get poofing, baby! Once before, I offered you peace. If you had not been so arrogant, you could have returned to your homeland with a fleet of ships. Well, she knows her fucking worth. You will flee Slaver's Bay on foot. 
like the beggar queen you are. We are here to discuss terms of surrender. Not the beggar queen. Not the fucking beggar queen! The unsullied you stole from Krasny's Mona Claus will remain to be sold again to the highest bidder. The translator you stole from Krasny's Mona Claus will remain to be sold again to the highest bidder. None of those things is going to happen. The dragons beneath the Great Pyramid will be slaughtered. None of it's happening. We obviously didn't communicate clearly. We're here to discuss your surrender, not mine. Yeah, period. I'm the one with the dragons, ho! Don't fucking snigger at me! I imagine it's difficult. Adjusting to the new reality. Your reign is over. I need to put some subtitles on because I don't want to miss a thing. My reign has just begun. Yeah, you don't know about me. You you can't intimidate me. Not when I've got this bad boy. That's simply not going to happen, my dear. You know? Like, what is wrong with some humans? Like, why do you think that you have it under control when you really don't? Period. Come on, Miss Diva, let's go burn some hoes. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm ready. Come on, then. This is what I've been ready for this whole time. Oh, my God, and the other two are out, too. Yes! I'm sweating already. Fucking hell. Oh, and it's the Sons of the Harpies back at it again. For God's sake. Yeah. Galloping hoofbeat. Yeah, that'll be that, you know, that Dothraki that we've got on our side now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that'll be them, yeah, absolutely. Dracarys. Oh, I'm so proud. I'm proud, I'm pleased, I'm elated. I'd be going back to these masters and saying, well, what do we think then? fled! Last time we spoke, we made a pact. You violated that pact. Absolutely you did. Big fat violation, if you ask me. Our queen insists that one of you must die as punishment for your crimes. Oh, I'd let one of my dragons have a good munch on that one, you know? Fucking munch on its head. Him. He should die. Yes, him. He's not one of us. He's an outsider, lowborn. He does not speak for us. I think the main guy should die. No, I don't think him. I think, I think that one on that side. He's the one that's not most of the top. Him. All that. That works. <laughs> Tell your people what happened here. When they come forward with ideas about returning the slave cities to their former glory, remind them what happened when Daenerys Stormborn and her dragons came to Marine. Absolutely. Now that's how you handle business. She's here on business, you see. She's a businesswoman. And she gets the business done. Oh, it's so good. What a way to start the episode. Guys, I've got great feelings. Great feelings. I'm sure that could be dashed in a moment's notice, but for right now, I'm feeling great. Are we at Winterfell here? Looks like it. And that's Sansa. Yeah, we're at Winterfell. Fucking, fucking fuck. Already. Oh my God, that's so scary. You see in Sansa. My beloved wife. Fuck you. <laughs> I've missed you terribly. Thank you for returning Lady Bolton safely. Oh, oh, that's not what's happening. Surrender your army and proclaim me the true Lord of Winterfell and Warden of the North. Period. You don't have the men, you don't have the horses, and you don't have Winterfell. But we have the gumption. Okay. There's no need for a battle. Get off your horse, kneel. Never gonna happen. 
I'm a man of mercy. <laughs> Just... I have to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> You're a man of utter fucking bullshit, if you ask me. Thousands of men don't need to die. Only one of us. Let's end this the old way. You fucking lying. So that's what the Battle of the Bastards is. <laughs> I keep hearing stories about you, bastard. I love that he throws around the word bastard. Bastard, bastard, bastard. When, when you're also a bastard, you know? The way people in the North talk about you, you're the greatest swordsman who ever walked. Maybe you are that good, maybe not. Well, one way to find out. I don't know if I'd beat you, but I know that my army will beat yours. Will your men want to fight for you when they hear you wouldn't fight for them? We've got a giant. We've got a fucking giant, we are. Ah! Will you let your little brother die because you're too proud to surrender? How do we know you have him? He has him. <laughs> he has him, babes. <laughs> yeah, that'd be the wolf's head indeed. Got it. To be fair, that still doesn't mean that they've got Rick on, you know? Technically, that's just the wolf. If you want to save You're him. going to die tomorrow, Lord Bolton. Sleep well. There's no choice but to stand. And that's on pussy, if you ask me, and she's the first one to fucking gallop off. I know that's right, strong, powerful woman. You're all fine looking men. My dogs are desperate to meet you. I haven't fed them for seven days, they're ravenous. I wonder which parts they'll try first. In the morning then, bastard. I do imagine for John at this point, like people calling him bastard is probably like people calling me gay. You know, I'm just like, okay. And... Folks, where's the lie? It's crucial that we let them charge at us. They've got the numbers. We need the patience. <laughs> Absolutely. You sit around making your plans on how to defeat a man you don't know. I lived with him. Mm. I know the way his mind works. I know how he likes to hurt people. Period. Did it ever once occur to you that I might have some insight? Literally, I'd have been letting her spearhead this whole fucking deal, I would. You're right. You think he's going to fall into your trap? He won't. He's the one who lays traps. He's overconfident. I've defended the wall from worse than Ramsey Bolton. You don't know him. What should we do? How do we get Rickon back? Oh, come on, Sansa, we need it. We'll never get him back. Hey? Hey? As long as he lives, Ramsey's claim to Winterfell will be contested, which means he won't live long. We can't give up on our brother. Listen to me, please. Oh, I'm listening. I'm listening, babes. All ears. Don't do what he wants you to do. Oh, that's good advice. You think that's obvious? You asked my advice earlier. I would have thought not to hang on to until we had a larger force. In fact, what would be? We have a larger force. We plead with every house that has the black bitch. Oh, guys, I don't think we need to be at each other's necks as well. You know. Battles have been won <sighs> against greater odds. Well, here's fucking hoping and praying, then, babes. I hope it is enough. I really do. If Ramsay wins, I'm not going back there alive. Do you understand me? Period. Kill yourself, I would be. I'd be offing myself there and then. I would. I won't ever let him touch you again. I'll protect you, I promise. And you better. Because I'll come after you. No one can protect me. No one can protect anyone. Oh, I love her. I, guys, I love Sansa. If only the, the one thing that would make her character even better for me right now, at this present day, would be if she could swing a fucking sword, you know? And if she could somehow help us here and like she was part of the battle, like, I would love Sandra to fucking get some. You weren't at the war council. I'm not a soldier. Any advice? Don't lose. <sighs> Terrible advice. Now that's obvious. If I fall, don't bring me back. I'll have to try. I am not your servant. I serve the Lord of Light. I do what he commands. He didn't command you to bring him back this time, did he? I guess maybe he did. Who knows? Maybe he did through Sir Davos, maybe, you know, like... Ooh. I have no power. Only what he gives me, and he gave me you. Oh, period. But you're old! You're an old maiden kind of girl. So where'd this fucking power come from? You know the thing that you wear around your neck that keeps you young and tight? Maybe you're only needed for this small part of his plan and nothing else. Maybe he brought you here to die again. Well, here's fucking hoping the Lord of Light knows what's good for him, okay? Because I'm not sitting here and watching Jon Snow die again. Neither Sansa. I will turn this show off and never resume. 
right? Be warned. <laughs> what the hell is that? Are they dead bodies or something? Oh my god, that's the reindeer that he made for... Or the deer, I guess, that he made for Shireen. Wait, is that... Is that it? That's the morning! That's all the fucking kip we get! Oh dear god. Last time we saw each other was at Winterfell, yes? You were making jokes about my height, I seem to recall. Oh gag, they're already there. It was a long time ago. It was. And how have things been going for you since then? Terribly. R really terribly. I can't imagine you would have murdered the Stark boys if things had been going well. I didn't murder the Stark boys. But they did things that were just as bad. And he paid for them. Doesn't seem like it. Babes, I've got no willy. My manhood's gone. My dignity's gone. All of it. You've brought us a hundred ships from the Iron Fleet. In return, I expect you want me to support your claim to the throne of the Iron Islands? Not my claim. Hers. I'm not fit to rule. Has the Iron Islands ever had a queen before? No more than Westeros. Here we go. She, she said, look, me and you both, babes. It's new for everybody here. There are more than a hundred ships in the Iron Fleet. There are. Then Euron is building more. So why shouldn't I wait for him? He also wants to give you... His big cock. Big. Huge. <laughs> <laughs> she doesn't mince her words, does she? But, I mean, everyone wants to give her their big cock. You know, it seems to be that's all she gets offered. And I imagine your offer is free of any marriage demands. I never demand, but I'm up for anything, really. <laughs> Period. I love Lezzie's. Wow. Your ancestors defeated ours and took the Iron Islands. We ask you to give them back. And that's all. We'd like you to help us murder an uncle or two who don't think a woman's fit to rule. Reasonable. Period. I like this alliance. I ain't mad about this fucking shit. I'm not. No more reaving, roving, raiding or raping. That's our way of life. No more. We're changing things, right? If you weren't aware, things are changing. No more. Cheers to that. Clink, clink, girls. Nice, the Loving Alliance. Fuck. Do you know what's quite shitty though? As the giant of the pack, like you're kind of going to be the... You're gonna kind of going to be the bullseye, you know? I feel like they're going to target the giant first to try and take that down first. Do you know who I really feel sorry for in these things, in these parts? Oh my god, Rickon's going to be on the end of that, isn't he? I feel sorry for the horses. Okay. Oh, I feel like he's going to murder Rickon. The way that Ramsey's going to antagonise would be to murder Rickon and have them get angry, you know? <laughs> that is correct. Run to your brother. The sooner you make it to him, the sooner you get to see him again. Nah, it's fucked. It's fucked. There's no fucking way. No chance. Easy. Go. No, you have to run, remember? I'd run, but I'd be running off. Oh, there we go. I'd be swerving, I'd be ducking and diving, I'd be rolling. Okay, I'm not making it easy for this bastard. There we go. John, I think this is a mistake. Because he's going to aim for John, isn't he? This is a mistake. I think this is a total mistake. I do. I hate. I hate. <gasps> yep, there it is. And what's happened? John, John's just, you know, left the rest of the people. Don't. Yeah, exactly. It's gonna go. It's gonna go. Of course he is. This is what he wants. John, I'm disappointed. I am. I'm disappointed. Now. Cavalry! Charge! 
You fell right into the trap. You know, the one that Sansa said that he, ta he tends to set. This is what he wanted, dickhead. Sorry, I'm gonna stop being so mean. Horse is whinnying, that's right, yeah. And you're stood there on your fucking Todd. Like you're shooting at your own fellas. Potentially. Oh my god, how have they shot this shit? Ah! Oh my god, guys, we are we are lucky. We are being struck with luck at every turn here. Oh, this is wild. This is actually crazy. Like, how are we even doing this? Like, this is no choreography, you know? This has got to be somewhat CGI and, like, camera trickery. <laughs> I think we're losing. That's an understatement. I don't! <laughs> oh. My. God. I will say, past the obvious that this is obviously scary, intense, and disgusting, right? War. We may as well be taking shit back here. The way they've made this is insanity. Follow! It's time. Go. How interesting, though, how John was the first one on his side to go out there and fucking go for it. And still... Rams is still just there spectating and watching. Says a lot, doesn't it? <sighs> Get fucking kicking, giant! Jesus Christ! I'd be swinging every limb! What are they doing? Are they surrounding them or something? They're creating a circle, aren't they? Bad. Okay, that's bad for us. That giant could surely just start bursting its way through. Come on now, throw some weight around. Yeah, we're fucked, I think. Oh, look at that. I've been impaled. <laughs> Oh it's oh it's terrible. Can we not climb over the bodies, you know? Oh no, we can't. Quickly, let's break the line. Come on, giant, get fucking slogging! grabbing all their spears and just throwing a lot of them. Grab the spears and throw. You know, that's, that, that's, that's the main thing. We need to disarm them a bit. Oh. We need a miracle, I think. <laughs> oh, it's awful, it's awful. Come on! Yeah, I'd be I'd be taking as full force as that way, me. They've got shields and shit protecting them. Let's get these men that are on their own. <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on here. 
This is going terribly, terribly wrong. We need a miracle, we do. What's gonna happen? It's getting fucking trampled on people. He can't get out. Oh, it'd make me so claustrophobic. I'd have already passed away, I think, just from, you know, just stress and like, oh my God. Oh, it's terrible. Guys, it's really, oh, it's really, really terrible. <laughs> Some fuckers army here to help us because we need it. <laughs> yeah, take the moment. Yeah, baby. Get that fucking jugular out. I know that's right, bitch. Who is it? Who is that? Birds? Little Finger? Is it gonna be Little Finger? Is he, has he got some sort of army? Cause, Cause Sansa sent that fucking raven, didn't she, with the note? It's Little Finger and Sansa! Fuck, fuck, fuck. Thank you, Sansa. I don't love that we had to obviously get Littlefinger's help, but I'll let it slide, you know, if we, if we, if we get out of this. <laughs> See, that smart. Sansa is smart. She knew it wasn't going to be enough. She fucking knew it. Look at her. She's like, yeah, I did that. You're all welcome. I hope we kill Littlefinger. That'd be phenomenal. Come on, Ramsay. Battle of the Bastards, one on one. Let's fucking do it, ho. Psych. Or are you gonna be a pussy, old? <laughs> Come on, Tifa. <laughs> or I think, is he actually gonna be a pussy, old? Surely not. Ramsay is being a pussy, ho. That's insane. I don't know if it's smart to follow them back to there. There's more people here that can help them. We have Winterfell. They don't have the men for a siege. All we have to do is wait. Well, they've got a giant to burst their way in. Absolutely. Absolutely, absolutely, absolutely. Fucking come on then! I mean, John's skinny, you can get through that little hole. <laughs> oh, that was hideous. <laughs> oh, it that giant really gave its life, didn't it, for the cause? Oh my God. Period, period and period. We're in, baby. And we're kind of slaying a little bit. Thank you. Thank you. For your service. Can we at least pull some arrows out of him, for God's sake? Oh. My. God. That was disgusting. Oh, and of course it came from Ramsay. You suggested one-on-one -on -one combat, didn't you? He's got to die. He's got to. There's no way this situation is, is, is going to have been that bleak for John to now die. I've reconsidered. I think that sounds like a wonderful idea. Oh, is that fucking true, is it? Now that I've exerted some energy. We are not a large house. We're a proud one. And look at him, the little pussy hole. I wouldn't give a fuck about one-on-one -on -one combat. I'd be, I'd be, if I were one of these archers, I'd have shot the motherfucker down already. I don't give a fuck about honor. Is <laughs> a pussy. 
pussy. He's a little pussy hole because he knew that he couldn't take John. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah. Get him. Oh, and Santa's there to witness it. Fuck yeah, baby. This is for you, Santa. Do you want to get a hit in or you good? Make him fucking pay. I hope Sansa at least gets gets to kick him or something. Kick him, please. Please. Oh, let me kick him. Drag him over there and let her slice. I think it's only fucking right. Ah! Yeah, bitch. Now, what are we plotting, Sir Davos? Because he's going to be mad about Shireen. So is he going to go after the Red Lady? I'm going to bury my brother in the crypt. Next to my father. Ramsay's not dead. John. Where is he? Oh, they fucking tied him up. Dog slurping. Oh, I'm feeding him. I'm feeding him to the dogs. He said they're not eaten in seven days. They're ravished. Here you go, doggies. Big fucking meal for use. <laughs> I love this. I... Oh my god. Hello, Sansa. At least he's calling her Sansa and not Lady Bolton. <laughs> Is this where I'll be staying now? No. Our time together is about to come to an end. Oh, thank fucking... Oh! You can't kill me. I'm part of you now. And that's the sick fucking twisted part. I think that's what he get, gets off on. Leaving his mark, you know? Your words will disappear. Your house will disappear. Your name will disappear. And you saw that because she killed Jadoff. All memory of you will disappear. Will the dogs eat him? If ordered to do so, do you reckon? Or do they only take orders from Ramsay? Because, I mean, they're sat there. I guess, I guess given the, given time. My hands will never harm me. You haven't fed them in seven days. You said it yourself. Yeah. Period. I was just about to say, given time, their hunger's going to take over any any other, like, loyalty they had to, to her master. They're loyal beasts. They were. Now they're starving. That's what I'm saying. Give it some time. They'll, they'll, they'll take the bait. Chomp, chomp, baby. Let's fucking go. Oh, and he's like bleeding and shit, so they're gonna smell all of it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna munch in it. It's gonna munch. I don't know if I wanna see it. Ah! Ah! Yes! And she is taking it in. Oh, yay! Period, Miss Queen, you fucking smirk. Well, guys. I'm pleased with that. But I don't think this feeling's gonna continue, because that's the nature of this fucking show, okay? I reckon next episode they're gonna end on some sort of fuckery. Because they, they don't, they don't, they just don't allow it. They don't allow this energy to continue much longer, you know? Oh, what a perfect demise for that son of a fucking bitch. Like, killed by the very same beasts that he's killed many a people, person with. Oh, I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. That was inc that was a cinematic masterpiece, I'll fucking say it. I will. Because past the storyline and the outcome and whatever else happened, the way that was shot is absolutely insane. Like, I felt like I was a part of that fucking war then. I felt like I was stood there right next to John, you know? Insane. Kudos to every fucker that created that, right? Whoever had, in a, had, a, had a hand in creating that, because that is wild. I love 
that Sansa were the, was the one that foresaw that this wasn't going to end well. And I understand you can you can have you can have gumption, you can have all the things in the world, but if you haven't got the men, that's one big thing that's always going to be a downfall. You know, like yeah, you might get lucky, maybe. But she knew. She knew what Ramsay's gig was. She knows that what he's like and knows that he likes to create traps and it, it creates the drama, you know? She knew that. She foresaw that and she had something there ready and waiting. Fucking hell. I'd be making Sansa the Queen. I would. I'd be making Sansa the Queen. Of Winterfell, that is, because... Technically, the only person, because I don't think John can't be, because obviously he's a bastard. Bran is still God knows where, you know. I'd be giving it to Sansa. Let her be the fucking queen. I'd live. And I reckon Daenerys would live. Anyway, guys, I'm going to stop chatting because this is another one of those episodes where I feel like I could chat for fucking ever. Okay, but I'm not. I'm going to stop myself because, oh my God, I'm now going to just watch the next episode. So you'll get that soon. But for now, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. I've got no idea what I was saying. I was too engrossed. So hopefully there's something coherent here. Love you guys lots. Um, see you soon, I guess. Love you. Bye.